The Birds and the Bees was a heartwarming episode of the much-anticipated Fraser reunion, but it felt similar to Jamie's reunion with William a few episodes ago. The end of 2018 was a relish for Outlander fans who finally witnessed an exhilarating reunion of Brianna Fraser with her father, separated by a time distance of 200 years, Jamie Fraser, in one heartwarming moment. Jamie Fraser, who does not instantly recognize Brianna, as she does him, even when she is facing his back, wipes her tears and embraces his little darling before reuniting her with her mother, Claire Fraser. The Happy Fraser reunion is short-lived, not only because there's an impending gloom of Brianna returning to the 20th century, to which she belongs, and her horrific rape by the villain Stephen Bonnet, but also because Jamie Fraser is insecure about taking up his position as a father to Brianna because the shadows of her father figure, Frank Randall, overpowers his presence. When Brianna and Jamie are shooting a gun, Brianna's bullishot makes Jamie commend her skill. She quickly answers that it's because Frank Randall taught her how to shoot. This seems to stay on Jamie's mind and Claire suggests Jamie take Brianna out for hunting in order to bond with her. That same early morning, even before the dawn has broken, Jamie takes Brianna out for hunting and that moment of picking up a rifle and walking around Fraser's Ridge strongly echoes the kind of bonding that took place a few episodes ago between Jamie and his son, William Ransom. Episode 6 of Season 4, right after Brianna had traveled through the stones, titled Blood of My Blood, was anticipated to be Jamie's reunion with Brianna. Instead, it was Jamie's reunion with his son William, who is legally fathered by Lord John Gray. The one heartbreaking episode of the season revealed Jamie's complicated status as a father. But before William, or Willie, as he is lovingly called, could depart. They were forced to bond as John Gray was fraught with measles, and Willie had to stay away from him. The father-son duo embarked on a hunting spree and Jamie distanced himself from being too attached with his biological son, who, of course, does not know Jamie is his father. In fact, Willie blamed Jamie for his father's sickness. However, the animosity did not last long. Jamie taught Willie how to hunt and cut open a deer. However. Eventually, Jamie was forced to confess that Willie is his son when the Cherokee clan tried to kill Willie for venturing into their land and killing a fish. That is when Jamie proclaimed his blood is my blood. Take mine instead. William did not buy it and courageously told the Cherokee that Jamie is just trying to save him. Because of his courage, they were let go. But deep within, it felt William knew. This time, with Brianna, Jamie kept calling her my darling in Gaelic and explained to her how to blow smoke in the beehive so he can collect the honey. Jamie, despite the similar situation of having another father in between his relationship, tells her that he does doesn't mean to replace Frank, who was a good man for raising another man's child as his own. You can call me to, Jamie tells Brianna. While in the case of Willie, Jamie fights hard to stop his fatherly urges because he knows he is being well looked after in the high British aristocratic family. With Brianna, he goes all out to prove his fatherly love towards her. So much so he even goes to fatally hit Roger, as he is mistaken by Lizzie to be Brianna's rapist. Coming to the point, Brianna's bonding with Jamie was a very touching scene, well executed by the creators of Outlander. However, the very fact that it echoes Jamie's bonding with William, who eventually left him, giving him the final last look that Jamie never gave to him makes you question if Jamie's fate to be a father isn't necessarily a sustainable one in this fate-driven drama. If hunting is the way Jamie bonds with his children then can anyone wait for his bonding with Joan, who actually helped Brianna escape?